I'm Terry Johnson, one of the co-creators of The Quirkles, and I have a young, beautiful scientist with me today. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah, and, and Sarah, what grade are you in? First grade. First grade, and Sarah, do you like science? Yes. Yes, you do. What about the quirkles? Do you like the quirkles? Yes. Yes. Well, we're going to do some fun science activities today that you can take and possibly use for your Valentine's party. Valentine's Day is coming up, isn't it, Sarah? Do we like Valentine's Day? Yes. Yeah, and what a better day to celebrate love and science in the same day. So we are going to make a bubbling lava lamp. This can be used with our Density Dan book, our Color for Caroline book. You can use it in various ways. In our bottle, we have it filled with vegetable oil. You can use the cheapest vegetable oil you have. It doesn't have to be expensive. We have it filled about three-fourths full. Now, what we're going to do in our styrofoam cup, we have water, okay? We are gonna just cap it off the top. You wanna pick up your cup of water? And I'll help you if you need help. And we're gonna slowly just cap off the top here. Good job. Now the oil was already in the bottle, and now we're putting the water. Wait a minute, something strange is happening. What's happening, Sarah? What's happening? Did the oil float to the top? Yes, it did, didn't it? Because we know that water molecules and oil molecules don't mix. So the oil floats to the top. Well, that's only part of the fun. We are going to take our food color, and you can use any colors. I'm gonna use a red because we can do this for Valentine's Day. And I'm gonna put a few drops of red. Can you take yours and just put a few drops of red? And then we can use any colors we want. Put some blue in there. And it floats down. But it's just sitting there. It's not doing anything, is it? But let's take our antacid. This is an antacid that you can pick up anywhere and break it up into small pieces. And let's just drop few pieces of antacid in our bottle and let's see what happens. Can you just drop it in your bottle and let's see what happens. Oh, let's see. Oh, what's happening, Sarah? It's getting colored. It is. And what's happening here? What do you see? Bubbles. You see bubbles are coming to the top, aren't they? Now what's happening is the antacid is creating carbon dioxide and look, and those bubbles are attaching to the water coming up to the surface and then going back down. Look, we're creating the colors. It looks just like a lava lamp, doesn't it? Sarah, sometimes at Valentine's Day, we say funny things or you'll see a card. And one of the things the card might say is, you really electrify me. Meaning I just really think you're awesome. Well, you can use that with science too. Sarah, I want you, this is an energy stick that I got from stevespangler.com and we're going to make a circuit. Now, Sarah, I want you to hold this in, hold that in and like this and let's see. Ah, oh, wait a minute, what's happening? It's not doing anything. We haven't closed our circuit, have we? What if we hold hands? What happened? We made a circuit, didn't we? That means that electricity is running through our body. Now, Sarah, do you want to see something really cool? I want you, this is a dry paper towel. I want you to hold this end of the towel. I'm going to hold this end of the towel, and then we're going to hold this end of the circle. Ah, huh, wait a minute. The paper towel isn't conducting electricity, is it? No, but let's watch this. What do you think if we put the paper towel in some water and got it a little wet? Let's see if water conducts electricity. This would be a great add-on to our LA Electricity book. Now, Sarah, hold the wet paper towel. Let's see, and now let's see what happens. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? 
So could we say that water conducts electricity? Yes, we could. So Sarah, you electrify me. That's cool, isn't it? Well, Sarah, thank you for doing your activities with me today. And check out some other experiments at quirkles.com or on our YouTube. Thanks for tuning in. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye-bye. Sarah, say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.